South and leader of his party. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, post-secondary students are struggling as the realities of COVID-19 continue to wear on them mentally, physically, emotionally, and financially. Unfortunately, these issues are magnified even more for international students, as many of them are left with no resources to pay for basic necessities. You can imagine a first year international student being a stranger in a strange land. These students have not received the same levels of support as domestic students throughout the pandemic and have had to resort to asking their peers, their fellow students, for support in their time of need due to the lack of government support. Mr. Speaker, it's important to not forget that international students are a key part of the New Brunswick economy, contributing around $96 million to the provincial GDP in 2017, alongside making New Brunswick a much more culturally diverse province as many decide to stay and make their home in New Brunswick. The government must step up to ensure that they have the necessary tools to continue their studies here in New Brunswick for the next semester. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.